And good evening. I'm Natalie. He in for Tom Ziska tonight. A manhunt continues in San Jacinto County for the man accused of gunning down five people, including an eight year old child. Fox's Shelby Rose spoke to the family this morning about the moments that led up to that deadly mass shooting. A Friday night spent with friends and family turned into something Jefferson Rivera and Wilson Garcia never imagined. Watching their family members die at the hands of a gunman who lived just next door. Yeah, you. This tragedy that unfolded, he had no right. We never offended him. We never disrespected him. Francisco Oropesa was allegedly drunk and shooting an AR-15 outside of his home near Cleveland, Texas. Garcia says he asked him to stop because a child inside was scared. The unthinkable happened next. Uh, I told my wife to go inside because he had loaded the gun. Oropesa forced himself inside their home, first turning his weapon on Garcia's wife, Sonia. That's when my friend told me to run. Sonia is dead. You have two kids. Run. We will take care of ourselves. So that's when I went through the window. Garcia returned a short time later only to see Oropesa still inside. That's when the suspect shot at me. He shot at me five times behind my house. When he didn't catch me, he returned to gun them down again and shot them on the head. Then the gun was turned on Rivera. I looked to my left and he was pointing his gun at me. He told me I was looking for you. I'm going to kill you. After throwing a machete at Oropesa, both men were able to run to safety. Now Rivera and Garcia are left to mourn the loss of their wives. Garcia also losing his eight-year-old child. The five people died. Diana and Julissa died covering their children. They died defending their children. And Oropesa is still on the run, which is terrifying for those who survived this tragedy. I'm scared because he can come back and look for us, but we're hoping that police do their job and arrest him. The FBI says hundreds of law enforcement officers from over a dozen agencies are actively searching for Oropesa, and he's considered armed and dangerous. Reporting in San Jacinto County, Shelby Rose, Fox 26 News.